Thank you for the two months of subbing there, and thank you, Smoke Shot, for the 13 months. Well, you know, maybe you missed the earlier one. Maybe you missed that one, which will be going up tomorrow, but hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hope everyone is having a nice, relaxing evening. So I'm still, I'm, I'm dealing with allergies still, which I, one second. I know it's amazing. I came back the day of my partner anniversary, which was so I did not even plan for. I almost streamed yesterday because it was like, you know what, I'm back. I could, but I I ended up just taking the day to rest and such, and nice and relaxed. Let me let me, edit this. Let me switch these. Oh, perfect. Uh, nothing like a nice ticking beep. Let me back up from this thing really quickly. You actually start in here, but I just wanted to to zoom in on that thing for the beginning. I hope everyone's been having a relaxing evening. I had meant to uh, continue playing the visual novel that we were doing before I had left, but whoa, <laughs> round two. Too bad I gotta get up for a. Hey, well, how hope you have? Too bad I gotta get up at it's work 10 at 5 a.m. It's 10 p.m. Good old me. Eastern time zone. Hope work is a nice and easy day for you tomorrow. Hope it's not too too much and able to get a good amount of sleep. I know exactly that feeling. I'm going to be raining in biddies for a second. Oh. I don't know why I'm so used to like, I thought 400 was going to last a lot longer. I'm so used to these. But I hope you guys are having a nice thing. Good old East Coast. That's what I, I don't know why. I was like, I was waiting for that to, that felt like it should have been longer. It might have to do with the size thing. Um, I'm trying to think. So recently I, I'm going to turn my fan on. It is too hot already. Says it's 82 in here. Hooray. <clears throat> Have a great night. So uh recently I was playing one game and during that game I go, wow, this reminds me of a game I played before. And then I was like, wow, I wanna play that. So in an upcoming video, you'll hear me talking about this game and now I'm playing it. So I talk about thinking about it in a video coming out, so so things are a little backwards. But uh, let me stop this beeping by grabbing the device. But this is Scanner Somber. I, I keep saying Sombra because the way the word is spelled, but it, it, it's it's Somber. And I think I uh, originally experienced this in uh, VR as well. But uh, here we are, and, and this is... So imagine you're in a really dark cave. But imagine you had a device that let you just paint it. It's the way the light dances off all the surfaces to show you how far away they are. If it's red, it's right here. If it's blue. And so this whole game is, it's supposed to be, it's an experience in a sense. But it's mostly a, I'd say it's a strand type game because you are trying to head to the end of the cave. Uh, I dipped my toes in this once long ago, and then I, last night, I screen shared it, uh, for a couple of friends. But other than that, I, I don't know too much that's, uh, going on here. It's not, so, there is, so the funny thing is, it comes in a bundle, and I sent it to Charlie of a, uh, horror game, like, there is a horror game someone made that uses this exact aspect and it's in a bundle on Steam with this game. But this is not the, it, it's supposed to have eerie aspects, but I don't think it's straight horror. I don't, I don't believe any monster is gonna come grab us. Nobody's been this deep for thousands of years. And it's kind of neat just like looking back and like you can see everywhere you've been and everywhere you painted. I was utterly alone. No call for help would ever reach the surface. Got a bit. Hey, Maya Doria. I hope I said that right. Thank you so much for the uh, sub. I hope you're having a wonderful evening. I hope you enjoy the stream. Welcome in, welcome in. And YouTube, thank you for the biddies. But I had to know if the myths were true. Because I also think about 
in a sense, standing here, you're in pitch darkness. The only thing you can see is based on your... It's supposed to say it's LiDAR, which is like light... V v radar, but... But... But it's like, it's so... I don't know, it's pretty. And it's like the, like, here's a stalag, I, I don't know, using this as, a, it's like the stalagmite, and it's like you paint it, almost. And the colors just show depth. Did Markiplier play, did he play it in VR, or was it, uh, flat? I like how I say flat. Because I'm, like, pretty sure I got this game when I borrowed, like, Tim or Max's VR. VR? Okay. Because I, I, I believe I played this when I still, like, lived in Washington. It was when me, Max, and Tim were in the Bellevue house. Is this the way? Oh, this is how we go deeper. I don't want to let go, I just want it to keep scanning. It's just so creepy. I don't know, it's like it's just neat seeing the tunnels. I'm trying to paint what's behind me as well. Especially the, uh, I don't know. Caving in general is scary. It's neat, the camera's painting the whole room. Don't fall. The music? What the heck? I feel like I'm in a use the mouse wheel. Focus blast! Big blast! The music reminds me of like a movie climax. I'm back! Hey, uh, You're sprinkling me, you sprinkling me with the biddies. Treating me like a nice dish that needs some salt and pepper. Focus blast. I really like- I don't know, just moving my mouse wheel is fun. There's the floor. Being able to see the bridge. Started all the way back there. I don't think I could ever experience this in real life though. The idea of, tra what if, all right, hear me out, like as an idea, you know how they have like escape rooms? What if they set you up in a dark room and like let you explore around a room with like one of these things? Hey, uh, and like they could change like, oh, different room layouts and stuff. So, you know, you have reason to go back. The glitching. Hey, uh, Ross, you got a sub. Bro is caked. Is he facing me? No, he's not. It's weird painting his shadow. Cause like I could never do this in a cave. But like doing this in a, a controlled environment seems like it would be neat. Huh? <laughs> Does he want a hug? Huh? 
Huh. He's not moving though. Hmm. Where my hug ahead? Yo, he's A posing. He's not T posing. He's A posing. So it's kind of like where everything's invisible and you can kind of picture this as a, a paint gun. And I've been, I don't know, it's, it's like a neat, instead of using sound like a sonar, it, it's light. Did I come from this way? No, because there's the man. He's still just... Yeah, he's just in the middle of that circle. He chilling. Now everyone's gonna say I remember when Ross played it. This reminds me because uh, around where I grew up, there was this place called um, How Caverns. I guess there's a way back up. What is that? It looks like something fell. Uh, and it was, it was like a story of some, I think his name was How. He was a farmer, lived on a farm. And he discovered, like, underneath was a, um, cavern. There's just a whole big old cavern. Oh, White Blood, thank you so much for the seven months of subbing. Sorry, I missed it before. And it's now like a, it's a tourist attraction. I've been there like a ton of times throughout. I went on a field trip there for school because you go underground and, um, brain, brain, brain. You go underground, so you go into an elevator and then they take you underground and then you get a tour guide, you get like guided through a cavern and they talk about all the uh, formations and stuff like that. And then um, afterwards, like towards the end, you get in a boat and they call it the river sticks because it's so cold. And like, there's a point where it drops off and they're like, yeah, we don't have lights or anything down there, so we can't go any farther, but yeah, the cavern just keeps on going. So you'd have to take like a boat ride down a waterfall or something. And like, I'm not even like a hundred percent, like I haven't been there in forever, but I remember during the holidays, you can go listen to caroling in the, uh, it's caroling in the caverns. And instead of getting a guided tour that like talks about the caverns, you just, there's just people singing carols. You just walk along the caverns and there's people singing. So it's kind of fun. I've experienced it like, mo like I've experienced it. I think I've been like four times throughout. So I've experienced it with singing, with color. Like It's funny. It was a, it's a neat thing. That's also where I got my first bag of collectible rocks. You guys all know that that tourist attraction spot fill up this bag with colorful rocks thing. They had that there and that was the first time I got to experience that. And it's a magical thing filling up a bag with rocks. Where are this? There's stair. It goes down, but that doesn't look like it goes up. No, that looks like a wall. I'm getting wall feelings from here. Oh. There we go. You forget if I tap my mouse button, it lets me uh, just leave it on. I can either hold the button or like just leave it scanning. Hey, uh, the cheese well, caves. Is that where they transport cheese around multiple? Can I make that jump? Oh, I can't, but I sure can land. <laughs>
Dude, you gotta do the puzzle yourself. If I can do it, you can do it. Move, 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 move. Ha! <laughs> he can't even do the puzzle. He's not big brain enough to do the puzzle. They never did iron out- no, it was just a glitch. They never did iron out all the glitches. No, it really isn't a pack with a horror game. This is not the horror game of the two. Sometimes you'd see sensor echoes from days earlier, calibrations turn to ghosts. That's kind of creepy in a sense because it's supposed to be like, it tracks where light bounces off of. Let me- I'm just grabbing the name if anyone- let me grab a link. Hey, uh, Ross, you got a sub. There it is. I was like, I messaged this to Charlie. It's called the Voidness LiDAR Horror Survival. That's the, uh, that's the horror one. <laughs> kind of interested. Kind of want to see Charlie play it. That's why I sent it to him and I was like, hey man, check this out. There we go. Does it split? Hey, uh, Ross, you got a bit. It's looking more. It's looking solid. Yeah, this looks. I think it keeps going. It's so cavernous in here. Mm. See, I'm happy we can all help each other and share information. It's a fun time. Ended up by, I spent like, I was working on practicing my typing and then I got distracted by watching how LiDAR works. Cause it is, it's the idea that like light, it's light bouncing off. And then you can see where the light has bounced. It's kind of like echolocation, but without screaming. I'm claustrophobic. Yeah, because when I was watching the video, that's actually so one of the ways they described it was because like sonar uses sound waves to bounce underwater and like sonar can actually it's like if you look into it, sonar is like harmful to some sea life and such. How do I get over there? It would be a LiDAR detector, I believe, or not detect, I don't believe it would be a detector, but like a radar? Radar? Because radar is rays, or like, wavelengths and such and such. Heyo. Can I fall? I don't want to fall. I don't think I want to fall. Also, don't... I don't think I can... No, I cannot make this jump. I guess it goes this way. It's just such a tease. Are you trying to push me? I'm not gonna. F you want me to fall? See what's down there? It could be spooky. Do it. Oh shoot! I slipped. <laughs> oh my neck! It's a good thing I brought my life alert. I don't like that they're all red. 
please turn back to blue. It's okay, I'm wearing a life alert. I used to wonder if you, like, I, I, so the way I would think about it is, was a life alert, like, tagged to a physical address? Or was it tagged to the device itself? Because what would happen if you tied a life alert to a balloon and then pushed it and then you let the balloon hey, uh, go? Ross, you got a bit. The ambulance can burrow. I've fallen. Damn. <laughs> oh no, I've fallen for you and I can't get up. Man, so now we know I don't want to fall. Man. I would not. I'm doing this one handed. 360. Like, I, I would not trust that. I would be crawling. Glitch. Oh. Oh. Oh, they're falling. The most recent thing, I I think it was on the YouTube channel, because I'm trying to remember. Fee horror story? Fe oh man, I'm not remembering. But it was about a pipe disaster that recently happened, and that left me just absolutely chilled. Hey, uh, it, Ross, you got a bit. That might not fatal breakdown. It was like scare the it might be scare theater. Scare theater sounds right. I I do believe the glitches are part of the game, yes. I think it's to to be a little spooky, if you would. It it was like scary interesting and scary sad. So I, I'm gonna sum up. It's it's worth a watch. It was a bunch of people went to go work on a pipe. They get sucked into the pipe. They're able to record for a while while in there. And the effort they made... Yeah, 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 yeah! Sca yeah. That one... Uh. And just how sad it is to hear the court proceedings of how they're like, Yeah, we just didn't want to risk anyone else. We made it! This time I didn't fall. And then, whoa! Hey, yo, can I come over and burst? Wow. Where do I, wow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna burst! I gotta find a big open room. I say as I immediately press it. Oh, that looks like I'm going into the mouth of a monster. I gotta say, so far this is very nice of a mood, like, I don't feel like I've gotten snagged at any part yet. Cause like, if I don't see a path, I just paint more. Hey, uh, Ross, you got a bit. Painting, painting, painting. It's so weird not painting the floor, like I wonder how far I can... Oh, this is weird. All right, I shouldn't do this. Oh, where am I? Where am I? What did I do? Oh, I'm I'm actually I'm a I'm a master of just parkour. I don't have to worry about this cave at all because I'm just a parkour master. I've trained in the way of cave jumping. Oh, 
Okay, there was another slide down. If I had made it to the slide down without scanning, that would have been funny. Okay, now this is looking like a staircase. This is worth a burst. Ooh. Wavy? Like how I can then like focus to fill in some more. Interesting. I'm too, I'm very, I'm too terrified to explore. I'll watch a video of a cave exploring. I won't do it myself. I have always wanted to urban explore. I've wanted to like go to an abandoned mall or something like that. I think that would be really fun. Like with friends. I would not do it alone. But I would want to do that with friends. There was recently- Oh, it was because of, uh, Lethal Company. I watched the videos that inspired, um, The Rolling Giant. And that was actually pretty cool to watch. Uh, because the Rolling Giant is, like, based off of an actual... Like, they made that for a parade. It's, like, supposed to be a Yeti float. Urban exploring by yourself sounds scary. Urban exploring with friends sounds fun. There was one place that's, um, it's by my parents' house in New York that's, like, it's an abandoned to birth. So it was so funny. Back in, like, so quick story. In 2016, I used to watch a good chunk, and there was this one guy called Exploring with Josh. And then I found out that my parents live by an abandoned tuberculosis slash insane asylum. Because, you know, you got to put the tuberculosis patients with the crazy people. Um... And then I ended up finding that it was, um, exploring with Josh, the guy I watched in 2016 went there and explored the abandoned tuberculosis hospital. It was just so funny, like, wow, he went to the place that I kind of am near. It's funny driving by there. I can't remember if it was convert. I don't have the full history. That would honestly make more sense than putting them together. Glo abandoned glove making factory sounds amazing. Yeah, this is where we get all the plastic. This is where we get all the nylon for the gloves. Now I'm going up. Is this what Braille is like to blind people? Alright, I'm sorry. That that was... That was out of pocket. I just see a lot of dots and I think like, well... Braille. That reminds me... So this is one thing that never made sense. I remember asking my parents as a kid, Why do the ATMs in the drive-thru have Braille? I know it's probably... And it was explained to me it's just because the, like, the machines have to have it. But I always found it funny to me, like, braille in a drive-thru. <laughs> Ellen Art isn't, but it's haunted. Answer hospital, but the doctor wasn't, and just sent... Jeez. Yeah, uh, yeah, you're here. Just, uh, go home. We don't want you here. Oh, here? Whoa, it's like a castle. I think if Ghost Adventures is the one with Zach Baggins, it, he is so funny. I remember watching a video where it was like one place like, yeah, they just made up this thing about how like dead people like the the mat. It was something about like mattress like people that die in this hotel. They put the mattresses here, but like, no, it was just mattresses. They were moving and they made that whole thing up. The temple must have been over a thousand years old. Is 
That's what I mean. <sighs> Talking about it and then actually doing it. It's also having play because it's a to finally see it in person to be the first. I kind of won't be seeing it in person because I'm painting it with light and I am parkouring. That sounds neat. An abandoned McDonald's. A haunted play place. Paint, 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 paint. Is this not the way up? No, this is the way up. Yo, that guy got horns. Uh-oh. They might have been doing some things that they shouldn't have been doing down here. It had the ball pit. That has got to be Pink Eye Central. Demons, are you there? It's your boy. I like ghost files. I also, uh, I think it's on Hulu. It was called Ghosts in the Hood or like Amazon Prime. That show made me laugh really hard because there's like one member of the crew who takes it seriously and everyone else is just like joking around and you can really tell like, I feel so bad for him. Dom, I could see you doing this, but instead of light, it's cum. Kudar? Cutter? C-U-D-A-R? Hope you've been doing good, man. Chicken wings, but the chicken is ice cream in the book. That is genius! You got a bit. Someone give this guy money. Someone give this guy money. Thank you for putting that back in my brain. I haven't thought about chicken, but but it's ice cream and pudding in a while. Is this a, uh, what is this? Scan around the, the more I scan around the altar, the more it revealed. Let's try hitting it from this side. So instead of chicken, it's ice cream, and then the bone is just pudding, and then you put it in a bowl, and you could serve it. Maybe I shouldn't be standing on the death altar. Like the more I paint it, it seems like it's bad. That's a heart. These look like little hearts. Aww. They're cute little necklaces. Oh, hey. Upgrade. I, I keep, you know, one thing I gotta say is I keep wondering to myself, what are they gonna, ch like, what upgrade can I get to this gun? What, what could I possibly upgrade? But then it's like, am I gonna get, like, better... Oh, I'm glitching like mad. Are they guarding it? Hey. Did they push him? Map? <gasps> no. Prison? Where did I start? <gasps> That's where we started. It's so pretty. Climbed up here. Then we got the thing that let it change. So I guess we're heading to the prisons and then the cult. Yeah, we haven't made it to the cultist monastery yet. 
And we have to head through the prisons. Okay, cool. Neat. Isn't it nice that there's upgrades left in these caves? Hey, uh, Ross, you got a bit. How many people did they throw down there? Wait, so am I supposed to use the map now to figure out how to get back? Oh, I see. So I kind I I do kind of see. So I got to go it's kind of to the top right, so I, I want to hang right. Across this Brit? Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. I'm... The only reason... I would do it normally, but I think it would just throw me back. Because the last time I walked off, it just kind of put me back where I was. Also, thank you, Azu, for the hundred biddies. Keep thinking I'm still just being sprinkled. The cultists believe the cave itself was malevolent and that the dead could never escape. Well, yeah, how is a dead person gonna escape? You put a dead person in a box and they're not gonna escape. Their victims were doomed to relive their final torture hours forever. Hey, uh, oh. Ross, you got a bit. Do you think they had like torches or how did, how did they see in the dark? No wonder people went hey, uh, mad Ross, down here. You got a bit. I'm being sprinkled. Thank you, YouTube. Vampires. Ooh. And they were vampire roommates. I am kind of, oh, I was like, I'm kind of getting turned around. Oh, are these the prisons? Oh, these are the prisons. Oh my goodness, that holy schmoly smoke shot. Thank you for the thousand biddies. What the heck? No, I can just hold it infinitely. The uh, burst is in the bottom left, though. You can see it recharge when I use it. Oil lamps and memorize the caves as much as they could. Very, tr actually very true. <gasps> A bench. Away. Oh my goodness, I'm just being sprinkled. Thank you so much, Havens. Mucho appreciado. I think that I, I'm trying to think if I've been a partner for three. I think it's three years. I actually did not even check the day, to be completely honest. Or the amount of years. Hey, uh, Ross, you Thank you, Lucy, for the 16 months. Hope you've been having a good one. I've been getting absolutely sprinkled like I'm an ice cream. I don't, I don't like, I was going to say something after I said I'm an ice cream, but I don't like what it would imply. So I've chosen not to say it. I actually need the map now because I got to head... I guess towards prison, prison three, I'm like in this chamber where five is, I guess I kind of want to see, oh, I want to go through, it looks like I want to go through four towards six. So yes, I want to look this way. What the heck? Yeah, I think I want to go over this. game is a uh, scanner somber ice cream ice cream ice cream ice cream 
wish I could remember the name of that one. That was a good, uh... I watched, it was, uh... I think it was Netflix. I thought I saw something for a second. It was like the Junji Ito Netflix stuff, and there's like the ice cream man. He goes, ice cream, ice cream, ice cream, ice cream. Alright, so I did make it to prison six. Looks like I want to hang a left. Hang a, yeah, I want to hang a left. And go through this doorway and head this way. Wow, the fact that I can read this map is amazing to me. Hey, all good, Shelly. Can always catch up or watch back later when you can. Hope, uh, if you were busy, I hope it was doing something fun and not dumb. Oh, sounds like we're about to hit a glitch again. Where? What glitch? This thing is not liking... ...something around here. There's like this rope. I don't see anyone down there. Ugh. You're in the bridge creek too. I think I want to go... Yeah, this seems like a newer path, because it was... Oh yeah, this is just a wall. I do want to keep going. I think Aya's done fan art of ice cream. I'd call it probably melty. Come get your melty ice cream. I don't know, that was just the first word that came to mind. I'd call it chicken wings, but instead of chicken, it's ice cream, and then instead of the bone that would be on the drumstick, it's pudding. The cultist slept and ate here. Uh, 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 disrespect, disrespect you cultists, uh, don't do cult things. Like the monks, monks who came after, they spent their time in silent prayer to an unanswering god. Wow, bro, you don't gotta get deep. Is that a computer? Someone's keeping a treasure chest down here. Tay, I will sue. Don't you dare say that. I lost Skull Man. I'm not losing my, my chicken ice cream. I think we just looked at Pop-Tart memes one time. I remember looking at them, but it wasn't me. And people like linked a bunch of Pop-Tart. Like it was like Pop-Tart, but it's Pop-Tart. Chicken wing. Keep hearing the glitchy noise. Is this like some food table? This actually is kind of creepy. It's a bunch of uh, tables and chairs of a cult. Now this dude was like, yeah, they used to eat and sleep here. I think I'm in a kitchen. I'm trying to make my way over to the monastery. It looks like I want to go... This way? But that doesn't, it doesn't seem right. Let me look again. No, it's like a big tree growing. Maybe I go right? Like, if I hug... This wall... I just gotta find an area I haven't painted that can lead me forward. 
So I came up here, over to here. So am I going this? Ah, this goes up. Here we go. The burst mode is very nice. That's where it's like, what upgrades are they gonna give me? How are they gonna top this one? Bear in his natural habitat. Waka waka. I don't have any. I, I I would make chicken wings, but I don't have any pudding. Where my hug? Yo, the cult of where my hug? See, I always hate because I know exactly what you mean, Aaron, and it's always like I never lay down and like immediately fall asleep when I want to at night. But it, it like oh, I'm like trying. I man, I never have that kind of sleep when I want that kind of sleep. Like oh, I can't wait to just pass out. All right, I'm at the temple. What do I? Do? Oh, do I go left and behind him? Map is good. I like map. Exactly. Like, yeah. Like, I've had so many times where it's like my head's not. I'm doing that head nod. But then when I actually try to sleep, like, just the act of moving to my bed has woken me up enough that, like, I now cannot fall asleep. You go from sleepy to, oh, you moved? Never mind, I'm ready to be awake. Thank you so much, Demon Wolf. Yay! I remember because my dad is a person where like he lays down and within like five minutes he is asleep. And I always hey, uh, thought there was some trick to stop. doing that. And I remember as a kid, I always thought like, if I tried to just lay... Oh, is it raining in here? Oh, there's water droplets falling off of the ceiling. That's kind of pretty. The way the water is shown... I think it's a mixture of dripstone and... I think that's water. Yeah, the way the light washes off. That's so weird to say the way the light washes off. The way water reflects. So yeah, I would, uh, I, I thought the trick was where I would put... I moved my pillow down like four inches and I was like, this is the trick. This is the key to sleeping. You just gotta lay lower in your bed. Did not work. Did not understand why. I thought that was the key. I was also like five years old. <laughs> Somewhere over the way. Do I have to go through the water? Oh, I don't trust. Lake entrance. Purging cages from the witch trials year 1680 approximate and then I can exit the lake. All right. Into the water we go. I can't use my technology while I'm in the water.
my name i don't know why that's like ingrained in me it's the crucible witch trials john proctor my name my name i won't sign my name oh no um What is, oh, is that the cage they were talking? No, that is not the cage they were talking about. Or maybe it was, no, it is not. I need to go left or right, it seems. Try to find somewhere where there's actually ground. So I can't actually walk here. I gotta just be careful of the water. I hope this is the right way. The witch trials came much later. No way they were coming all this way to trial witches. <laughs> no way. I almost just walked right in. They used to drag witches down here and purge them in huge numbers. Evil throughout the ages. Why, who would spend this much time they could have did this so much earlier in the cave. There's no doubt they believed in the myths. It was no accident they chose this cave. Bro, context clues. Is this not where I'm going? Is it the other way? That's honestly when I hit a dead end, just try going another way. Hmm. No. Oh, okay, now that's pretty. The way the water is actually reflecting the ceiling. How do I get deeper? <laughs> My normal strategy of go where I haven't painted isn't working. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha, oh. I'm trying to use the map to see where I haven't been. Because it looks like I go... I'm going to just go for it. Man... And they say wait 30 minutes before uh, getting in the, the something to uh, tummy rumbling uh, 30 minutes before swimming. Oh boy, I think it's just another short trek through the water here. Ninja Hippie, thank you, thank you for the 60 months. I hope you're doing good. Come back, come back, come back, come back, light. There we go, refill it in. There we go. All right, we're back on track. We are lost for like a second. It was... I want it. No, it looks like it just hits a wall the other way. I was like, does it go the other way? But it looks like, because this is uh, heading towards the purging cages. I did wonder if it's true, of course. No way, these were just glitches. What? 
that there's ghosts. That much death occurring in such a confined space, what horrors must they have seen in their final moments? That guy's twerking! That guy's twerking badly! No, don't stab me! My final moments was watching some dude twerk badly. Ooh. Maybe this will let me paint water, and then I can stand on it, and that would be epic. Oh, did I pass the cages? Wait. How did I pass the cage? I wanted to see the cages. Hey, yo, wait a minute. You can't tell me there's cages and then... Oh, there they are. So you can't tell me there's purging cages and not expect me to want to go see them. Okay. Ah, uh, it's just single player. I don't even know how this would be multiplayer. You race? I'd push my friend. Push him in the water. I think I just go for it. As much as I hate to say it, it feels like a, I just go for it. If this is not the answer, fuck it, we ball! It was not the answer. <laughs> okay, so I think there's something in the water. Okay, so it put me back at the entrance of this room and then deleted a lot. So yeah, when you die, it deletes a lot of the dots. I don't think I died, and then I think the monster grabbed my little leggy in the water. And my little leggy in the water. A little toe dip. Dipping my little toes in the water. I can't tell if that's like, am I supposed to just like rush to that? I guess I'm gonna, that doesn't seem right though. But that kind of seems like the only place to go is there. So I'm gonna try it. I don't think this is the place, oh. No, this is not the place to go. I'm about to get dragged. What was that? You know, I don't think I did what I was supposed to, but I think I'm just so awesome that I did it. Well, heck. Uh. That kind of threw me off. Okay, this is the way I'm going. Oh, was I supposed to like... I'm gonna try and paint this way. I honestly think I messed up and got myself lost by going somewhere I shouldn't have. Because yeah, like here's these cages. Oh man. I think I just, I think I speed run skipped. Or I go this way. I either speed run skipped or I go this way. I'm gonna figure it out. Yeah, I'm a scanner somber speedrunner. I'm actually a bug snack speedrunner. I can't I can't goof you guys. If I had games pass, I'd uh, quickly bust out a bug snack speedrun for y'all. These bug snacks. Whoa! 
Talking about bug fix. Fake exit is the way I am currently facing, but it look okay. I'm gonna follow the path. I'm gonna pretend what I said is right. And like, whoa, I did go the wrong way. I accidentally turned around. Now I'm going the right way. Cause this does feel like it's a right way. I just gotta find, cause there was that blinking. There was the upgrade in the distance. I think it looks absolutely, absolutely atrocious. Epic Mickey sucks. I've never played it and I have not seen the trailer or remake at all. <laughs> oh, it's like when I'm in the water. Guys, get up. I'm turned around. I'm a little lost. I gotta find that upgrade that was in here. Because I know as soon as I get that upgrade, I'll be back on track. I could... I could, uh, die reset too, because that'll at least put me back where I was going. But we were all the way at the purging cages. And it looks like... Maybe I would have come this way. Climb up here. I'm so turned around. I came over to here. I already tried this. Let me open the map again. I'm facing a wall. No, I am facing the lake exit, and it's like, I want to go... Straight. Here. This is what I wanted to do. That's how I was turned around. I don't know where my upgrade is. I might have missed it. I really hope I didn't miss it. But, I know I'm at least back on track now. Haha, <laughs> Nick knack The patty's back! See, I just had to use my brain for a few minutes. What do we got? Anything solid or is that all water? Am I gonna have to make a run for it? Looks like a short hop, skip, and a jump. Hey, buddy. So breaks the machine for a second. Hey, we pass and we into the three hundreds for the farts. I just want to make sure before I make another run for it. I'm gonna wait for the burst scan. It seems... Oh, pardon me. Yeah, it looks like I just gotta go for it. Alright, what's our new upgrade? Sensor upgrade the scanner resolution! That's actually amazing. It fills in so much more now. That like, that is like a noticeable difference of like fill in, which is so nice.
Now, I was wondering if that would just be an upgrade where it's just like, yeah, it's just a, a scanner at that point. Marva, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a great stream yourself this evening. Thank you, thank you, thank you for raiding. I'm playing the game Scanner Somber, which is a neat interactive kind of experience so far. Okay, I am still heading this way. I think I can climb over that. It was a good vacation. I'm happy to be back. Uh, I kind of, I get bored. I like seeing my family, but I get very bored when I'm back. It's one of those, like, I think it's part of just me being far away. Like, if I live nearby, I'd see them more in a burst and be able to, like, do my own thing more often. But, like, when I'm with my parents, I, like, I cannot do much while I'm back home. I can hang out with them and it's nice, but it's only so many days. I missed hanging with my friends. Nice. Made it through the lake. So crazy. So crazy looking back all the way to like the start. The chasm when we got the map. Did we fall down a chasm? When did we go straight down? Huh. Oh man, my tummy is rumbling. Sorry if you guys heard my stomach. I don't know why, this is like opening up and I'm kind of getting a nice like, yeah, I'm kind of zooming. It's getting very open. I don't know, as open as a cave can- I'm saying that, but yeah, I'm still in a cave. <laughs> wow, this is a really open cave. Oh? Oh no, okay. Looks like we're not done on the river just yet. Are we going this way? <gasps> Under the sea. Under the sea. It's weird, yeah, I have to like, let me actually, I'm gonna do this just to paint the boat. Now we can see the boat. <laughs> We're in the tunnel of love. Are those still a thing? Are those last time I I feel like I thought about tunnel of love was left for dead. Secret tunnel. Can you guys believe that to open the secret tunnel you just need siblings to hold hands? That's the real meaning of the secret tunnel. Siblings holding hands. Spongebob that's I remember fairly odd parents. I remember Oh, yeah, they didn't want I think it was something like Ang and they they removed the romance aspect of Ang and Katara So rather than have them kiss it's uh Katara and Sokka have to hold hands The music is so peaceful. That's I, though, uh, group of friends all watched it together while I was gone. They're actually watching. I, I, I was invited to watch a movie, but because I did not stream earlier, I was like, you know what? I will stream. So I'm missing, I'm, I'm missing a movie with the, the buds. 
But I'm having a lot of- this is interesting and neat. I think they finished it the other day. I still think uh, there was one actor. I, I, I want to believe it's a real article. I might have read like a fake article, but it was something where he thought he was applying for like Avatar the Blue People. He didn't realize it was Avatar the Last Airbender. I was going to go back to Animal Crossing. I was getting frustrated about not getting a, uh, what is it? Fishing rod. It just, one thing, I think I saw Oppo put it, it's like because of all the changes they're making, it just kind of feels like they didn't have faith in the original, but the original is so good. Keep like not wanting to scan, but I, can't. I gotta scan to see. What? Where is this music coming from? It just got so loud. Oh god, it's back. If anything, I just kind of hope the new Avatar series pushes people to just go watch the old Avatar. I gotta finish Korra. I've watched like half of Korra. I remember, I remember watching, uh, it was like when Korra's first season was ending and the broadcast messed up. So like the ending, the last episode of the, the season just, it didn't have audio or something. It was really weird. Hey, Dan the Warrior, thank you for four months of subbing. Hey, uh, Open, Ross, why did the acrobat instructor cross the road? Someone on the other side could still... <laughs> oh man, I bumped. I boat bumped. Alright, you get that one. Isn't it more... It'd be the sound of, like, the droplets and such. It'd be natural. Natural sounds forming a song of nature. Ooh, big cave. I gotta say, the way the water reflects the light is what I think is so pretty. I was getting worried there actually wasn't something on the other side. It's like a bug snack, except it's a guttural, 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 guttural. Instead of bug snacks, they're instruments, the creatures. Hey, oh, Mike. How go, how go? Hey, thank you. Thank you for the happy, uh, the pink. Thank you so much for the happy part anniversary. My brain keeps flubbing up the word. I keep wanting to just say anniversary and then like partner verse or uh, Oh hey, another upgrade? Hey. Okay. You do be mining. Mining away. Way, way. I don't know what material sensor? What? So many have died down here. I kind of like the material sensor and I kind of, I don't know. The green is interesting. Like I can't tell if I like the green. The rated person ended the stream the same time. Oh, that always stinks when that happens, when it like lines up. 
But those that lost their lives to negligence, are they trapped down here? Too? What is that? Wood? I don't know, it's like I kind of like this and I kind of don't. I kind of prefer the I don't, what are you, I'm, hmm. I don't know. I'm so, I know I'm being all mixed and like, mm, it's like, I kind of like the upgrade, but I kind of like the rainbow. Cause like, it does kind of help me see some of the material. They're falling. Mm. I'm going this way. No, I'm not going this way. I go next to it. No, how do I cross here if the bridge is broken? Oh, they just fell from above. I guess switching between them is kind of neat. Also, Rainbow, thank you for the 10 months. Let's go with a cute old Charlie. Mr. Charlie boy. I love how my brain is just like, got it. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. I see what you mean. Actually, yeah, it does kind of give a better sense of depth. I like switching between the two because it's like I like the colors, but the it lets me know. I guess it's like the idea that it's like a material change. Like this is no longer just a stone. Like I could kind of make out with my brain that that's wood, but this kind of like helps the brain focus more. Honestly, I'm, I'm guessing this ends with like some kind of twist that I die. This mod also maybe stop the glitches? No, the glitches are still happening. Never mind. Yeah, there's a bodies. Oh, that kind of hurts my head. Oh, that's the industrial accident. 84 dead year 1948. It's a broken hand. I'm like, is that a lever? Oh, hey. This, this thing like just I do I go forward I guess it's weird seeing I just want to paint over here real quick I know this isn't the way to go but it looked like I don't know it's just interesting seeing the echoes I don't know now I'm getting more used to this mode like material mode Darn it. All right. That was not what I do. All right. Hey, I'm equipped. Hello. Hello. Thank you for the biddies. Hope you've been doing good.
Okay. That's- I think that's my third death. This is the industrial accident. Oh yeah, this is the industrial accident, 84 dead, and it causes the glitch. Head to sleep just one. Hey, I hope you have a great night and a good day tomorrow. Thanks for popping in. You can always catch this on your own time, as you know, as you know. I hope you have a great evening, and thank you for popping in. That's, uh, this is my only game for tonight as well. Okay, so back here again. Okay, they're unveiling that bridge. And this one is... I'm, like, trying to see where it's pointing. Do I- did I, like, just- I hate saying, did I just miss the plank? I, like, want to try again. You were saying an elevator. I'm gonna look around a little more before I try again. Oh. No. Hmm. Maybe I did just miss the jump. I don't know. I'm just trying to see. Cause it more, the way I'm seeing it is it's that board. I, no, it is not that board. Okay. It heads towards that elevator thing. All right. I will not try that again. I'm done trying that. I'm sorry. Okay. Crunch. Normally, when I, hey, when I'm lost, I can normally look at the map and figure it out, too. So, I'll give a, I'll get this censored in and then take another look at the map. Hey, this isn't the first time I've gotten lost, so I will figure it out. Alright, so these are lighting up this, and that's what, it makes me think this way. The one way I never went. Cool. Alright, yep, we figured it out. Cool. That was such a hard thing to figure out. Go left. What would you do for a Nestle Crunch? 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 Le Punch? Does it matter that all of this is in- Does it matter that all of this is in my memory? What? Does it make it any less real? What is he- What? I was there. I was the first? Bro, what is this guy saying? Hardcore parkour. Falling friends, falling friends, our friends are falling down. Falling friends, falling friends, our friends are falling down. Falling friends, falling friends, our friends are falling down. Memorial Museum opened 85. It was open for four years, it says. I could see that that's like a plaque, I'm guessing. Chica from Five Nights at Freddy's, what are you doing here? Or Freddy Fazbear from Five Nights at Freddy's, how did you get into this cave? Or, or. Is 
this place like buried? I want to see. What did it say? Sorry, the years on that was, was it night? Yeah, nineteen eighty-five. Eighty-five. Oh man, it's so weird seeing it like that too. I'm gonna pretend I didn't read that. Getting a little cramped. Is that another upgrade? Wait, what is it in? I remember coming down like it was yesterday. Am I? Oh? Hoping I'd find something below. Hoping it wouldn't be another empty cave. Just wish I'd been better prepared. I feel like I'm not supposed to be on this side. This way just seems blocked off. It's a fence. Was there a way? Ah, uh, here we go. I'm now wondering if he's a miner. I'm also wondering if I'm a ghost. What a twist. I don't want to say I don't want to say I'm dead. I'm getting the I'm dead vibe. But I kind of don't I want it to be a different twist. I want to be wrong. I don't want to spoil no spoilers. So if people know. Actually, it's kind of funny in the caves. It kind of feels like this helps me with my depth more. But in that like area, the materials helped more. Like when it's all green, it's not that helpful. When it's actually other materials, it is helpful. Wait, did I turn around? Oh no, I'm on the other side. have to turn oh maybe I have to turn all three on or maybe it's open now yeah this one's now open that seems like it could be the path but I just want to look this way first oh Nah, that looks like a death now that I look at, like, how far of a drop it actually is. Now this is kind of helpful. Seeing that pipe and such. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. It won't let me... It, like, makes me stop painting. 
and it won't let me go by. I'm scanning things I'm not supposed to be. So maybe I am supposed to fall down. And I'm gonna give that area a try now. That LiDAR belongs in a museum! You belong in a museum! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Just you, me, and this LiDAR detector. I see it, but I gotta get to it. helping in here. Oh wait, that's where I... Is that what I'm looking for? Shoot, I'm getting turned around. That's not good. That's really not good. <laughs> It goes this way, over to there. I need to find a way through. So I see this, but it's not helping me. I do keep going this way. Yeah, I'm gonna take this left. Mm. Now it feels like I'm just going backwards. I don't remember painting that before. No, this is where I came down. Dang. Okay, so I did get turned around. That stinks. Do I follow this? This is kind of new. Honestly, this seems... It's taking me in a new path, so I like it. I like it. Wow. Oh, I don't like the water sound. I don't know, whenever I hear water sound, I think of the fellers coming out. It sure felt like a maze. <laughs> So hopefully I don't have to like do all that again. I think this will be a way around. Oh yeah, nice. A way that, yeah, it spits you out so you don't have to go. Cool. above me as I can.
Nothing like the ambience of a cave. Actually, I kind of want to hit the small of the verse. And I know it is fantastic. Like, it really captures the mood. Like seeing the line come together, like where it burns together. I thought I heard a bird. It was Charlie. I was about to say, yeah, this all sounds metallic. Hello? How many times do I have to relive this? Oh, no. He was talking about how the dead have to relive. Always the same rock, the same metal, the same stale air. And the guilt. I just want to see my family again. I don't know how I died. No. Of all the memories I'm forced to relive, it's the one thing I don't remember. I think a fella's gonna get me. They are always here for me. Thanks, family! Alright, note to self, do not go into the water. They know I'm never coming back. Is that- is that red light supposed to be in the corner? It, did I mess up, like, scanning as I started the cutscene? Is this gonna do, like, a fly-through of the whole tunnel now? This is pretty. me. I fly. Very interesting game. 
nice little like experience like kind of tucked in like this is this is falls into the category of like games or art i feel Like it's fading away, like how the game over faded it away. Charlie, don't headbutt me, you goofball. I noticed this when I started the, uh, the family photo. Remembered my first aid kit. I hear the beeping. That was kind of neat. It was, it was a very interesting story. It's funny too. I kind of want to put on because while I was looking up this game, their next game looks hilarious. Like it looks funny. I don't know if this is just credits. Yo, Alistair Lindsay. Amazing job with the sound and music. Dean, great level. Yeah, John, you programmed that game. What the heck is New Game Plus? What? Why are you screaming, Charlie? What is New Game Plus? I'm not playing again. I'm just curious. Like, is this thing already upgraded? Yeah, this is how it starts. Like, we're in gear. Oh. I just want to see what's behind. I never actually at the beginning like turned around. So I guess you just get to start with every upgrade. Yeah. And then you can see where everything's going to be. That's kind of neat that you can. Wrong Wire was our version of what is now budding bomb defusal game genre. We wanted to make something that was entirely what? Prototype game you just finished. This prototype has the first version of the level base based didn't actually end up run prototype. Oh, it's making me what the heck? It's making me launch something else completely. What the heck? Oh, this? Wow! Alright, let me switch the source. That's actually cool that they have the prototype built in. 
Okay, this should switch in a second. This is the prototype. Huh? It's funny, it makes absolutely no noise and the fo- it, it sprays so hard. It's kind of funny, this is how they prototype the game. Yeah, this will be the game. That's kind of funny. It's cool they included that. I want to see what the other thing is. Oh, the bridge scene. Okay, so no matter what, they were keeping the bridge in the game. That's funny. This does have kind of like early level build going on. I'm not going to play through the whole prototype. I got to relaunch the game though. Because I want to launch the other demo. Oh wait, what happens when I hit escape? You can just hit restart. Uh... So let's see if I can enter a console. I thought maybe there'd be a console or something and like you could cheat. Alright, let me real quick relaunch and get the other thing, and then I want to play the trailer for their other game, and then I think that is going to be it for me tonight. <laughs> what the heck? Baldur's Gate 3 has a 17 gig update. Extra, so it was in the extras. Oh yeah, the wrong wire prototype. That's kind of neat that they, I, I don't know, I'm a sucker that they, it's neat they put prototypes for their other games. Like, hey, check out this other stuff we were working on. What the heck is this? Oh god, I'm running out of time. What is this game? Locate detonator circuit with four colored wires. Identify... Uh-oh. Okay, um... The power wire. All right, so let's see. So we're looking for the power wire is sometimes in A. Uh, you know, sometimes we gotta, we gotta, okay. So it, 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 it might be an A. It's kind of looking like it's a B. The power is, is green. So I think I, I cut the, okay, I cut the green wire. Oh, cool. I disarmed the bomb. Okay, next. All right, let's see what we got here. All right. Uh, throw this thing off here. All right, we got, you know, it's just, uh, it's just a little bomb. We can do a little bomb defusal. Oh, no. All right. Uh, what the heck? Nope! 7243? 7, 7 2, Why don't they put me on the bomb squad? Look at me. How do I unplug this thing? There we go. Cool. Alright, next bomb. Oh, this one's getting ominous. Charlie, why are you why are you shouting at me, Charlie? Okay, this one opens up. Um type numbers randomly. Give invalid thumb scan, cut wrong wire, panic and die. Alright, locate the detonator circuit. Is it uh oh wait. Where I gotta drill something off. Oh, there we go. There we go. I was trying to find the, the thing. It doesn't seem like it started yet. Da 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 da. Bomb squad, Ross. I'm dead.
I need to see the restart button. How many bombs are there? <laughs> what is this? What is this? <laughs> oh, oh, guys, I don't, I don't know if I, guys, I don't know if I'm uh, certified for this one. <laughs> Good luck, America. I have my duty. Oh God. Um. Okay, I plug it into there. I'm, oh man. Uh, oh, and then we then we grab this. My my other tool. Okay, then we plug this one in, and and, and then and then uh uh we we put in uh uh. I need that other machine too. What is happening with this? No. Uh, F. F. Should be zero. There's no X. Nine. F. Nine. It's just a little bomb, Ross. You can disarm it. I think it's- I think I can start snipping. It might be safe to start snipping. I'm gonna be real, I don't know what I'm doing here. Can I just yoink that? I'm gonna drill something here. Can I reclose the panel? Where am I? Holy heck! Trying to get over to here. All right, I can plug this to here, but like nothing, nothing showing up. That's that's the pro. Huh? Okay, maybe that's the serial inspector. And then I, th then I need this thing to plug into here. But I don't know what I type on this one. Uh. I guess we'll make this an eight and four one nine A. And we'll bring this down to be an F one B. You guys would trust me to disarm a bomb, right? Like you trust Bomb Squad Ross, right? Oh whoops, I pressed a few wrong buttons. Oopsie. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. Uh E two Seven three. How do I turn the serial inspector on? I don't think the serial inspector works. You know what? Oh, and that's the last bomb. I don't get how that one it like it wasn't working. My two up top is messing up. Okay, let's see. So like, I grab the drill. Okay, open this up. My two up top is messed up? Oh! I see what you mean, I see what you mean, I see what you mean. Charlie, what, dude? You just keep coming here and crying. Are you going, Ross, I haven't had a treat in 20 minutes, please, father. Zero. 
four B zero E. Why am I I'm I, I'm playing the prototype bomb game now? Yeah, it's sixty-nine. A six nine seven C one three six A I got an idea. I think I know how to turn the bomb off. I like when in doubt, just clear it out. I don't know why I didn't think of that this the first time. Then no one's even gonna have to worry about a bomb. <laughs> Yeah, I don't get this one, I'll be completely honest. I don't even think it's armed. Like, I, I, I think they just, I think that, I think this is like a, uh, headlight fluid test, you know, in the bomb squad. They go make you disarm the nuke and laugh at you in the other room as you can't figure it out. Seriously, can I just grab the pliers and start pulling? Is there like, do I need to like get at the underside? Whoa! I was not ready for that. I want to cut something. I cannot figure this one out. I cannot figure this out. Oh, 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 ha ha! Disarmed. I don't think I don't think it was supposed to be in the bomb like this. I think it's disarmed. I think I did it. I cut every wire. This thing still does nothing and this thing still does nothing. Yeah, this room stinks. It's kind of a neat, like, prototype, though. Alrighty. Yeah, just in, 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 in. When in doubt, just drill it. What's it gonna do? Explode? I wonder how I would have gotten through here. just do something oh and there's restarting there's buttons in the corner uh quit all right let me show you guys this trailer and then i am going to head off for the night almost did one big one and then i and then i cut it into two let me get this open really quickly <laughs> gotta open up this trailer it's by developer this. Oh yeah, I forgot. They made Prison Architect too. Is it not an upcoming? I thought they put this out. I swear, I like saw this game and I was like, whoa, is it by the publisher? Wait, sorry, I know you guys can't see anything. I'm just trying to figure this out. I go to their website. What the heck? If I can't find this, I'm gonna go. What the heck? I think I clicked something in the game. All right, let's see if I can figure this out. This is the fun part. Where was it? Community hub.
<laughs> Library, level select, extras. Hmm. Pardon me, or not. There's a game I saw that I was like, wow. And now I like, just can't even find it. And now I just can't even find the thing I'm looking for. Like Diablo, you should check out Last Epoch. It's pretty dope and better than whatever Diablo 4. I mean, I haven't even played 4. Egg poachers. What is this game? But I, I don't... I don't think this exists anymore. I'm, I'm like, I'm oddly confused at like, oh, it was a different game. Oh my goodness. Never mind. It, it's not by the people that made this. Oh my goodness. Never mind. Uh, I found it though. I found what I'm looking for. <laughs> uh, it's this developer. So then I go to this store page. It's the developer <laughs> of the longing. Because I was considering uh, trying to play that game again in the future, but it's kind of tough just because of the it's part of it's the way like it plays. Was their new game? I gotta go to developer studio. I have an upcoming Lucky Tower. Here we go. And then I need to share my screen. I think I can just do... Is this gonna work? Oh my god. When I get out of here, I'm gonna publish my theory about... Okey dokey. I don't know, this game seems goofy. When I get out of here, I'm gonna publish my theory about... You're not good at creating job openings. Kill some monsters for me or else. A bamboozling roguelike adventure. Immortality. Meet your master, Riddle Blaster. <laughs> Body slam! Hello, Mr. Frog. I don't. Go it seems. Into the door. Son of a schnitzel. <laughs> Looks like yeah, a tartoon. It feels like a joke. Abracup room! I feel like I've been in this tower before. Farewell. Whoa, I didn't see that coming. I don't know, it looks goofy. Uh, not by, it's by, uh, the people that made this game. That's the soundtrack. The game. So, something funny, The Longing, apparently they're like, this game is only supposed to be experienced once. The only way to restart the game is to sit on the game over screen for 10 minutes, and then it goes... Are you sure you want to restart? But Lucky Tower looks kind of funny and goofy. And I'm wondering if that'll, uh, I hope that game looks like it'll do good. But yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me tonight. Thank you for hanging through Scanner Somber. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was quite a fun experience. Uh, who's awake at this hour? Who's still actually doing stuff? Ow. I am, I think I'm just gonna end off for tonight. I hope you guys had a wonderful evening. Thank you so much for all the gift subs, biddies, and everything in between. I always appreciate y'all. I'll be streaming again tomorrow, so I'll see you then. And I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your night. Thank you for hanging out again. And goodbye. 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 Goodbye.